More breaking news tonight as the concerns over the coronavirus reach the valley. A person in Maricopa County is in isolation after being diagnosed with the deadly virus that's spreading rapidly. Team 12's Erica Stapleton joins us live from Tempe with what we're learning tonight. Erica. Rachel, this is the first confirmed case in Arizona. Health officials in Maricopa County tell us that the person affected is a part of the ASU community, an adult part of the ASU community, but they have not told us whether that person is a student or a staff member here. Now, we're told the person traveled to Arizona from Wuhan, China, where the outbreak is reportedly originated. The person reportedly called their doctor, showing mild symptoms, which can include fever, coughing, and other respiratory issues. From that point, the person has been and in voluntary isolation in their home. Health officials confirm they are not in student housing. It's very similar to any other type of communicable disease outbreak that we normally run, such as measles or foodborne illness. They will be following up with individuals that we believe are close contacts of them. Dr. Kara Kreis says coronavirus is most contagious when a person is showing symptoms. They believe the patient was not showing symptoms while returning to Arizona from China. And Sky Harbor tells us health officials have not requested they make any changes at this point for travelers. Dr. Kreis says the risk of catching this is pretty low if you haven't been to Wuhan, China and are not in close contact with anyone that's been affected. Now, we did reach out to ASU about what protocol is now that there has been a confirmed case of coronavirus and they have not responded. We also talked to students who said that they have not yet heard anything from the university about this. We'll have more later tonight at 10 o'clock. For now, we're live in Tempe. Erica Stapleton, 12 News.